Shoppers, I'm back again today and for today's video I'm going to be filming my once a year annual Black Friday haul. I always look forward to this video um, every year. Um, they're one of my favorite videos to watch and I also really like to make them. So anyways, I went Black Friday shopping. I didn't go too crazy and I'm not one of those people to go out um, on Thanksgiving night. Uh, to go Black Friday shopping. I feel like that just takes away um, the whole value of Thanksgiving. So I just braved the lines the next day on actual Black Friday and stood in the long ass lines that the I stood in the long ass lines that were in these stores. So anyways, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it and I hope the lighting is good. I tried to film where I can catch the best lighting so I'm not sure how this video will even turn out. So let's get started. Okay, so the first place, well not the first place, but the first um, place of item that I got I'm going to show you from. I don't even know if that makes sense. I don't know what's wrong with me. Anyway, so I went to the um, Bloomingdale's outlet store and I just picked up a new wallet as if I needed another wallet. But anyways, this is from the brand Penguin. I'm not sure if you guys are familiar with this brand, but it's a really nice um, men's brand that sells clothes. Um, shoes and accessories so yes anyways so I got this brown leather it's real leather um, wallet and what really drawn to me what really drawn me to this wallet was the inside it's like this really just kind of crazy pattern on the inside and I really like stuff like this where it's just like basic on the outside but when you open it up it's very just different and I know Ted Baker makes wallets like this where the outside is just um, plain leather and the insides will be some sort of crazy pattern so it kind of like inspired me to get this because um I don't know I really like it and I got this for 40% off of $19.98 so ended up being like um with tax $13.12 so I got that and it's really good um I can just switch up different brands of wallets um because a lot of my wallets are from coach but I kind of like to mix it up every now and then so Got that at Bloomingdale's. And then I went to um, Nordstrom Rack. And they were having an additional 30% off their sale items. So I picked up this um, long sleeve black shirt. This is from the brand Smash. I've never really heard of that brand, but who really cares? So it's just this black long sleeve with um, just like different colored skulls on it. I really like this. I actually tried this on, I want to say over the summer, but... I kind of held off because it was kind of expensive, even though it was at Nordstrom Rack. But I really do like this, you guys. Um, I don't know. I just think it's really different and really unique. And I got this for 30% off of $11.98. So, yes. So that was the only thing I picked up from Nordstrom Rack. And then I went to... Aeropostale. Now, I'm not a big Aeropostale fan. I've never been a big Aeropostale fan, but I feel like lately they have been stepping it up with their um, clothing game. Like, every time I go in there, I always find something now. And before every time I used to go in there, I used to just be like, ugh. But um, anyways, let me show you what I got. So I got this hat here. It's just a black, kind of just regular beanie with the white stripes. And I got this for $5. It was originally $14.50, so I guess that was part of the like Black Friday deal. I also got um, this super thin hoodie, and it's just, um, it's blue in the front. It's got a pocket here, and also has a hood with uh, polka dots. I really like this. It's super thin, but you can just layer this with a jacket, and I really got, I got this for super cheap, you guys. I got it for 50% off of $5, so it ended up being 3 so literally, like, nothing for that. And then the last item, I actually wore this already. This is from their Brook. Brooklyn Calling NYC collection. I'm not really sure. But um, it's like this marbled just zip up hoodie. I really like it. It's just very basic. Can never have too many hoodies. And the back just says um, NYC on it. I really like this hoodie a lot. I got this for about $6. So I got that. And the last place I went to was the Gap Factory outlet. And I picked up this really nice chunky knitted cardigan and it's in this um, really nice oatmeal color I don't have a cardigan that's this color so it's like this it's just really nice um, I don't know what this is oh 
It's just really nice. I can wear this with a scarf and some skinny jeans during the winter time. And I got this for 40% off of $29.99. So it ended up being about um, $17. So that's pretty good, especially for Gap. Even the Gap um, outlet store can be pretty expensive. So probably for something like this, it would have originally been like $50 or $60, which I would never pay for that. But um, yeah, so that is my Black Friday haul for this year, you guys. If you have any further questions, as always, please feel free to ask. I hope you all had a wonderful Thanksgiving with your family and happiest holidays to you guys. Um, this is my favorite type of season. Look forward to a lot of like holiday videos and like gift, gift gifting ideas. Did I even say that right? I don't even know. I'm like delusional right now. But um, yeah, so if you guys have any further questions, as always, please feel free to ask and 